So I know you announced a new product this morning. Can you explain uh, what it is and what it does? Yeah. Uh, first, we're really pleased to be able to announce it here at Strata, what's now become the epicenter of data, data scientists, and analytics people getting together. Mm -hmm. And it's the quintessential data product. What it does is it takes all of the information on LinkedIn, other professional places, put it together for you to be able to discover new skills, find out what those skills mean, who are the key people there that are in that skill, uh, people that are hiring, the top companies, even the top locations of what those skills are. And putting it to you in front of you in a way that's very highly navigable. So what sparked the product? Was there sort of an essential problem or issue that you were trying to address with it? It comes, one of the things that in a professional network that we found is there's this notion of what do you have in common? What is your similarities? There's experience, there's expertise. But as you start to dig down, there's this other notion of collective skills. What are the traits that you have as a professional? Mm -hmm. And what we wanted to do was find a way to expose it. One of the things we found that people often have is they don't know what a skill is or what their skills are. Mm -hmm. And even more importantly, what are related skills? And the reason that's important is a person that knows Java may not, who may feel like they're getting stale, may want to try to find additional skills to actually learn mm -hmm. and evolve. And us helping people facilitate that is is really a big part of that notion that's very uh, important to us of being able to provide a daily business insights mm -hmm. and two career insights. Okay, so how does it work, right? So uh, the uh, the skills extraction mm -hmm. that's going on does it does it come from LinkedIn profiles? Are you aggregating from various sources? Yes. So we use all the information that is flowing through LinkedIn. Mm -hmm. We also use. Uh, how the network is structured, and we also use sites like Wikipedia to, to help provide relevant content, uh, such as a description of that skill. And one of the things that we spent a tremendous amount of investment in doing is taking all of that technology, putting it together, uh, technologies that power things like people you may know, which was invented at LinkedIn, or uh, when you post a job, it gives you the 50 best recommendations mm -hmm. for people. All of that put, gets put together in a way that surfaces that, that material in a new way. And it's, there's a lot of secret sauce that goes into sure. it. And mm -hmm. that secret sauce, as I was mentioning during my talk, is actually the people. It's people, all the people on the team being very creative about doing things mm -hmm. and finding new ways to take data. No one's ever taken this much data, put it through all these different ideas and ways to expose it and make it in a, a fully interactive way so you can browse and learn this collective amount mm -hmm. in you know, the click of a button in, sure. in you know, just hundreds of microseconds. So last question I have for you. Can you walk me through a couple of the use cases? You know, so if I'm uh, just a regular person who wants to access this and to learn about related skills or skills that are supposed to be related to what I do, mm -hmm. uh, how would I go through that? Yeah, I think there's... At the, the very first, the most central part for LinkedIn is you. Mm -hmm. It's you as an individual, as a professional. Key to that, what skills are on your professional profile record, your profile? Because when you get searched on Google or Bing or whatever search engine, you want to come up. So making sure you have a complete profile. Understanding what skills should be in there. What do those skills mean? What are also the related skills for you to start thinking about as you evolve your mm -hmm. career? Two is for the person that may be trying to hire, because a big goal of LinkedIn is to be able to take you, the individual, and connect you with econ economic opportunities. Mm -hmm. And to do that, you have to have the person that has the skills, and you have to have the person that is looking for those skills. And be able to do that together is, hey, what are the skills? And showcasing and facilitating a way to do that. So getting that, enabling that layer to work. Mm -hmm. The third is, People are just curious about learning and just trying to understand like, oh, I don't, this sounds like something interesting. I don't know what that is. Sam, so today, it turned that we were looking at some of the interesting, like cheerleading. It turns out there's an incredible industry around cheerleading. There's another one around weightlifting, mm -hmm. bodybuilding, or things even like iPhone, Hadoop. And you know, for us in the tech community, it seems to really, that those are easy. But for a person that may be in another part of the world, you may be in India, maybe you're in the Ukraine, those, 
being able to actually get access to what those skills are and mm -hmm. who they are, and also the forums, the groups where people interact and have discussion on those topics, we believe is going to be very empowering to the professionals. Great. Well, thank you very much for being with us. Appreciate it.